Mattel started off the 2014 year with a pretty cool super chase, being Trike Feldman, an Italian souvenir vendor. But after him, it was downhill from there as the next two super chases were just minor variants of main characters. But nonetheless, here we have Trike Feldman and now let's get into today's suggestion video. So thank you Sharon Corrigan for the suggestion, I really do appreciate it, and although suggesting is currently closed, you can still make your birthday request if you haven't done so already, just please let me know at least one month prior to your birthday. So now let's get into a review of Trike Feldman, the first 2014 Super Chase. Trike is an Ape, which is a European three-wheeled vehicle, hence the name Trike. And now he is the same model as Sal Macchiani. Here is his 2012 release and here is his 2014 release. And yes, it is a pretty big variation from the original release, but all three of them are Apes. And now as you can see, Sal has a trailer or a storage container in the back, whereas Trike has a shelving unit here with some racks to hold Francesco Bernoulli souvenirs. As you can see, there are some flags, some of those red balls, and just some other random things as well. Now you may be wondering, where did Trike appear in the Cars 2 movie? And he did briefly appear in the alleys of Porta Corza when Finn McMissile was driving to try and catch a Greminacer with the camera. And of course he ended up failing, but Trike was in the background of one of those alleys along with a bus that looked to be the same model as Emmanuel. It just looked to be a yellow version of that. Now he does have a pretty interesting expression. It looks like he's kind of upset or disturbed. Probably, probably because Finn McMissile just blew by him in the alley there. Now as you can see, he has some American flags which is kind of weird because most of the things on him are Francesco paraphernalia, so I'm not really sure why he would carry some American flags, but who knows, he might be a vendor for multiple racers. But as you can see there, there is a Francesco toy, it looks like, kind of maybe like a plush toy right there. And he's got some red balls, like I said, it looks to be the Italian flag right there. And very nice detailing, I like it a lot. Now unfortunately, the back half of him is plastic, only the front half is metal, but that's to be expected. A very, very small car. Now I believe in the package of Trike, the, this part up here came separate, so you'd have to attach it. Now I bought mine online, so it came like this and it was loose, so that is why it was already attached. Now you may be thinking of Francesco Fanmater because he has some of the same things on him that Trike is selling. First of all, you can see the Francesco plush toy right there, which is pretty cool. I really like that they add that. I just wish it was more detailed because it really is just kind of a green blob with four tires. But I mean, plush toys wouldn't be that detailed anyways, but they would be a little bit more detailed than what's on the die cast here. Now, Mater here got a Italian ball stuck in his headlight there, or the socket for it, which are similar to these balls right here. And he also has some other flags right there, which Trike is not selling, but he does have this F flag for Francesco. And I just like to point that out because it's kind of like a shared thing right here, where both of them have some of the same accessories, which I find pretty cool, similar to Ludwig and Trent Croto with his luggage trailer. So that is all for Trike Thelm, and he's a pretty cool Ape here. Now let me know, do you prefer Sal Macchiani or Trike Thelm? And now for me, this is a pretty easy decision because I definitely like all the accessories on Trike, so I'd have to go with Trike Thelm, but I really do like Sal Macchiani with his dirt detailing on him and his two interesting variations. But yeah, that is all for Trike Feldman. I think this is kind of a rare super chase because it didn't really hit retail that much. Although it did hit all these stores quite a bit. I remember in 2014, 
They weren't really being found at Targets or Walmarts, but if you had a local Aldi and you went there during the Easter season, the chances of you finding one of these trike Thelmans was pretty high because most stores were getting them in. So if you had quite a few Aldi stores around you, you might be able to get around 10 of these, which I know one collector that actually lives south of me in Illinois got a lot of these. Now, unfortunately, I didn't really know of that because I wasn't on the forum, so I had to get mine online, but no biggie. So thank you guys for watching and thank you Sharon Corgan for the suggestion. I hope the video lived up to what you'd hoped it'd be. I'll see you guys all on Saturday for another video. I'm hoping it's a pretty exciting video with some brand new cars in it. Hopefully I can get them in time. So I'll see you guys then. Bye now.